Hello and welcome back to my channel and today is super special because Gigabyte actually sent over their new monitor and I'm not only going to review it, I'm also going to give it away to one of you. So if you've been wanting to upgrade your setup, gaming, editing, whatever you want to do, this might be your chance. This is the Gigabyte MO27Q28G. And the highlight here is that it uses the new fourth generation WOLED panel, which is a huge upgrade over the older OLED technology we've been seeing in the past few years. So let's run through the main specs real quick. It's a 27 inch WOLED panel, primary RGB tandem OLED technology, significantly higher peak brightness than previous OLED generations, improved color reproduction, more accurate and more vibrant, ultra fast response time it's OLED so basically instant 0.03 millisecond gray to gray response time and 280 hertz refresh rate deep blacks and infinite contrast smooth gaming performance it also hits up to 1500 nits of brightness covers dci p3 and bt 2020 color spaces and it does it with reduced power consumption compared to previous OLEDs My cat says hi. So literally this monitor is aiming for both worlds creators who want color accuracy and gamers who want speed and contrast. Now let's talk about WOLED because I know a lot of people hear that and they get really confused. So traditional OLED monitors light each pixel individually which gives you amazing contrast, deep blacks and fast response time. But the limitation was always brightness and long-term durability. So this new panel fixes that. WOLED stands for white OLED, but here Gigabyte is using something even more advanced, which is primary RGB tandem OLED, which means there are actually two OLED layers stacked together instead of just one. So now I tell you what it actually does. You get much higher brightness, whites pop, highlights pop, HDR looks better, better color performance, less risk of image retention because each layer doesn't have to work as hard and longer panel lifespan. So it fixes the weakness OLED used to have without taking away its strength. So how does it actually feel to use this thing? Honestly, it's kind of insane if you think about it. The color looks extremely rich and the brightness pump is noticeable even if you've used OLED before. Whites actually look white instead of slightly tinted. For editing especially, if you work in Premiere or DaVinci, the color accuracy matters a lot. Skin tones look way more natural on this panel. Aiming on this monitor is where it really flexes. The instant response time of OLED makes everything look insanely smooth. Shadow detail is crazy because OLED pixels turn completely off so blacks are truly black. And if you play shooters, competitive games, or anything fast-paced, Motion clarity is going to feel way smoother than a traditional LED monitor. And with the increased brightness, HDR gaming looks significantly better compared to older OLEDs. And of course, like any other OLED monitor, you still want to be mindful of static images. The new tandem design does help with longevity, but it's still smart to use screensavers and take breaks, and of course, enable built-in protection. And now for the fun part, which is the giveaway. So to enter, make sure you're subscribed to my channel, and a Yoris, like this video, comment below why you want this monitor, and I will choose someone from the comments. And I'll leave more instructions down in the description for more bonus points. And I'll announce the winner in two weeks on my IG and TikTok stories, so make sure you're following me on there too. And again, very, very, very huge thank you to Eoris for making this even possible. And thank you to you all for um, following and you know, also making this happen. Eee. All right, bye guys. And don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Bye.